Microsoft Access on Building Search Criteria 10. Since the last video I've done a few minor cosmetic changes. I've taken out the default 4 and 4 here and 4 here and I've replaced that top one with Smith and I've added into Table Main over there some Smiths. Smiths with a 1 following, Smiths with a 1 preceding and Smiths with 1 each end and 2 the same. So that uh, I could test the SQL statement in a query. I've also gone through and adjusted the spaces. To me that looks perfect now. So I think the next stage will be to show how to use this SQL statement. It's all very well having this nice SQL statement but what do you do with it? I'll just do that in the next video.